Using the WordPress ChatGPT AI Assistant plugin, you will be able to provide 24-7 support to your website visitors. All the answers can be based on your provided content. So now let's click on the ChatGPT AI Assistant plugins icon and test the new feature. For example, let's ask the following question. So here is the answer. As you can see, the chatbot provided us the step-by-step uh, -step guide on how to create a personality quiz using the QuizMaker plugin. Uh, that is, uh, there is no need to wait until the support specialist will answer or, um, I don't know, try to do it yourself. You can just, uh, your website visitors can just write their own questions and get the answers within the seconds. So now let's go and see how we can activate this feature for our ChatGPT AI Assistant plugin together. So for using the new embeddings uh, feature added in the ChatGPT Assistant plugin, you will need to use the pro version of the plugin and after installing and activated, activating the plugin, you will need to move to the embedding submenu. And here you can see that there are two sections, general and embeddings. Let's start from the general. First of all, you will need to activate the enable content embedding option. Uh, otherwise, you will not be able to uh, make use of it. Uh, so as you can guess, for activating this option, first of all, you will need to get a Pinecone account. And in case you do not have one, let's see how you can create it. Just click on this link uh, provided in the plugin and here you can see the sign up free button. Let's click on it and here are the options using which you can create your own account and uh, choose the appropriate one for you and click on the sign up button. So after creating your Pinecone account, this is what your dashboard will look like. Here you can see that we have the indexes submenu where we will need to create our indexes. As you can see, I have already created an example, but for creating a new index, all you need to do is to click on the create index button. Here you will need to write the name of your index and in this case, let it be test. Here you will need to write the dimensions and as you might have remembered from the step-by-step -step guide written in the dashboard of the plugin, the dimensions must be the following. So write it here, choose this option and then click on the create index button for creating your new index. But besides index, we also need the API keys. Now let's go to the API keys submenu and click on the create an api key button again we will need to write the name of the api key let it be test and click on the create key button so our api key is successfully created so in case you have already created the api key and index all you need to do is to pass in them into the appropriate field and click on the connect button so as you can see, the system shows that the connection is successfully done. So after connecting, here we can see that another uh, section is opened, which is select post to embed option. Here we have post and page options, which means that we can choose between posts and page that we want to be embedded into the uh, AI Assistant plugin. So this means that in case we choose the post and pages, the plugin will learn all the material included in it and then provide answers based on them. So uh, if you have chosen these options, the system will embed all the posts and pages included here. But in case you have chosen a specific one, the system will embed only the specific uh, post or page. After that, you will need to click on the embed button and that's all. For the final step, let's move to the embedding submenu and here are all the posts and pages that are embedded into the ChatGPT AI Assistant plugin. That is, if your website visitor asks questions connected to this content, they will get the particular answer based on them.